What's up everybody? My name is Nathan Haston. It's so good to see you again. Um, today I'm buying a new car and as you can see behind me, this is the vehicle that I currently own. It's a 2008 Ford Escape and I'm so sad because I'm losing her. But she died apparently. Um, the muffler broke. There's other things going wrong with her. But uh, her name is Magnum and uh, I'm so sad. I love this car so much. V6, good gas mileage, safety features and everything. She's been a really good car to me and uh, I'm kind of sad I'm going to lose her, but let's have a go at her. Let's look at her real quick. I'm already late. I hate being late. I don't like it, but I just wanted to give you a go at my car real quick. She's so pretty, and I'm so sad, <laughs> but as in all good things, this too must end, so... Let's get going. This is car. Tell me always love you. Not sponsored. It feels it almost feels like I'm going to put my dog down. I had to put my puppy or my uh, German Shepherd down in 2011, and uh, this doesn't feel anywhere near this, so I'm making an analogy though. Just the feeling in my stomach is similar to that. It's not as extreme or anything, but it's just the knowledge that this car is leaving my neighborhood for the last time in its, in its existence. I don't know. It's like a coming of age, I guess. I'm 22 and I'm just now buying my first car. This one was given to me by my amazing parents. And uh, my dad actually had a fight today over some stuff. And it makes me really think, you know, was it worth it? I have great family. I have great parents. And, you know, do I really want them out of my life? Or do I want them to, you know, help me with everything? I'm going to this. I'm going to this now by myself, um, which is kind of sad. Um, granted, my dad did catch a run. Um, so he had to go deal with that, but it's just, you know, it's just a sad, I don't know, I'm doing this by myself, I'm kind of scared about it, but I guess at the same time it is time for me to get out of the nest a little bit, so. Um, I'm going to take this car to the max. Oof. See that? Hear that? That's just pure beauty. And I don't even have that nice of a car, but it's just so nice to know that I have this vehicle. So I am going to get off of here though. I do want to save some video feed. I'm using my phone for the dealership. I want to offer the dealer some, uh, you know, some time to, if she wants to promote herself, she may. Um, and I'll ask if I can say the Ford dealership that I'm going to or not. So thanks. Catch you on the next one. I'll catch you here in a few minutes and uh, you'll be seeing my new car. I'm so scared. It's a 200 some dollar dollars a month it's upwards of 200 dollars a month plus my insurance which is another 100 so it's going to be upwards of 300 400 dollars a month for this new car and i haven't started my online business yet or anything and I'm, I'm you know so i'm kind of strapped for money right now i'm kind of poor i've never felt this way before so you know we'll see this car really wants to get around me so go ahead i'll see you later both cars Side by side, there's a dude behind me, and I think this is hilarious that he's probably watching me. But, uh, gotta get those views, right? That's the new car. I'm buying a freaking new car today. I'm flipping out. Oh, gosh. Take one better inside. Remember that feeling? Remember that feeling I told you about? Let's get even more real. I've got the paperwork and everything. I'm about to walk into the building. Oh my gosh! I'm about to buy a new car. Okay, so it's the next day. And I gotta wrap this up because I have to get to work really fast. But.
There she is. Or he is. It's that boy. In the car. <clears throat> it's an immediate new car smell. So we're going to try and keep that as long as possible because that is my all-time favorite smell in the entire freaking world. I love that smell. It's amazing, unless it's like perfume or something like that. There's a lot of good smells in the world, okay? Um, so it's the next day. I've got it. It's in my driveway, and there's so many awesome features on here. Um, I will do a car tour as soon as... Um, um, you know, as soon as I have time to do it and everything. But until then, until then, um, let me just tell you that it has, I'm like talking fast because I have to go and I'm trying to think. It has a touch start button. Touch start. It's got all kinds of cool features in it. It's so amazing. I am so much. I'm thinking I'm going to name him. I can't tell. I can't decide yet. Carson or Tamron. I'm thinking Tamron. It's Russian. And, um, but Leave a comment down below what you think I should name the car. It's totally blacked out. Black rims. I'm going to get it tinted black. Um, it's amazing. I love it. It's really fast, too. It's so fast. Um, I'm like, I'm putting it in parking spots. Like, I'm going over the line. I'm pissing people off. But I'm going over the line <laughs> so that way people have more room on their one side than the other. <clears throat> so that way nobody scratches my car because it's my car. And this one chick that I was talking to, she was like, oh, come off of it. It's just a car. I'm like... Woman, I am excited just because you're not excited and you don't like that other people have happiness doesn't mean that you can keep me down. And I am going to be making videos soon. It's going to be on an online, online business and I'm going to be talking about how you can become happy. You know what? People give me this one compliment all the time. How are you so happy all the time? And I'm going to lay out specific steps that you can take. 21 day detox and other things that I know that help me to stay happy and stay motivated. Because there's a lot of bad things that happen in your life. There's some things about me that aren't perfect. Who cares? All right? I'm going to lay that out to you. Uh, and tell me if that's something you'd be interested in as well in the, in the comments below, all 24 of you. You know, bump that up. So if you like this video, or even if you didn't, like, comment, subscribe, share this video. And um, in the comments below, remember, leave me a what kind of car you think I should, uh, what, what name I should name my car. And... Um, if you'd like to know the secrets to happiness and one more comment, if you're looking at for a car, of course, leave comments below if people have other ideas and other suggestions. But for me, uh, the people at Don Hines Ford, perfect people, not sponsored, but I just thought I would give some, uh, some feedback to them and, um, go talk to Janet Leonard, Janet Leonard. She is awesome. She helped me. She, uh, she won't lie to you. She is very friendly, very trustworthy, very uh, kind, and she will help you build the car that you want. Of course, she gave me the car of, um, that I never thought I could ever have or afford. So it's great. Trust me. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Oh, I forgot to show you the rims. Look at that rim job.